Hey folks, welcome back to another episode. Uh, today we're going on an adventure. Um, you're just gonna have to stay tuned. Um, but let's get on the road. It's so <laughs> cool. What is so special yeah. about this world base over here in the car? Ah. Whoa. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Okay, as you can see, I now have this uh, little squirrel face over here in the car. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're going to Fuet Pets and possibly Colchester. Colchester. I want to see what it looks like. So if they're open, we're going to swing by and uh, visit the Colchester Pet Shop, the home of Ernie Kurluski. Where are we going? Curly 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 Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to the back, back to another episode. <laughs> words, words. I'm here with Salty Alley. We are at Wet Pets. You can't see the neon signs on. I don't know what you're doing, Donnie. It might be broken. But anyway, the open signs on. We're here. We made the trip all the way out to Vernon, Connecticut to come see this place. But more importantly, I came here to buy a certain piece of coral. Um, yeah, and we just really wanted to see it. So let's take you guys on inside and show you guys what wet, pet look, wet pets looks like. Man, I can't talk today. Oh, he kicked water out of the tank. Yeah, he did. They're so cute. What do you think? I love them. Scott, we need stingrays. We totally need stingrays. <laughs> Are you excited to get your new I am coral? excited, super excited. <laughs> what else did you get? I also got a really nice trachea that I'm really excited about, so I can put it with my other one. Can't wait. Okay. <laughs> Alright, Donnie. So, what's so special about this hammer I just came to pick up? What is so special yes. about this hammer is, <laughs> if you actually give, look give close little, at it, give a little peek. now that we have it not you know, easy to see, can you get it in there? Yeah. Um, so, if you look close, this hammer is actually fused together, so it's not just two different colors put together, but it actually must have come out of the wild this way. And uh, so cool. we don't think it's man-made just because it's not that big, and if it was man-made by the time they grew in, it would be the size of a basketball. So it's yeah. pretty awesome. Either way, I think it's, it's absolutely insane. Um, and when I saw this piece, I just absolutely had to have it. So I called up Donnie and I was like, hey, that's mine. <laughs> don't sell it. <laughs> so drove an hour and a half yes. and there it is. Yes, we made the trip, the, the Vikingage, all the way out to Wet Pets to pick up this exact coral right here. <laughs> Listen, we live in Rhode Island. So every everything's farther than 20 minutes. 12 seconds later. We got the goodies, guys. Thank you guys so much for tuning in today. Uh, thanks to Donnie at Wet Pets yes. and everybody else here for helping us out. Yes, team at Wet Pets was absolutely fantastic. We enjoyed coming, seeing and uh, viewing the shop, this tank sidetracked. I'm like a rabbit or a squirrel. Those are the coolest quarries I've ever seen. Open the door. Let's go, Allie. All right, guys. Adios, wet pets. The whole crew, Donnie, everybody, thank you so much. We had a blast. Wow, it's not raining anymore. Um, yeah, time to drive these uh, beautiful corals home, and uh, we'll see you when we're putting them in the, in the tank or something like that. Stay tuned. Three weeks later. So you guys have seen the rest of the video up until this point right now. If you're still here, thank you. 
Uh, now we're basically going to show you uh, what the corals look like uh, that we purchased from Donnie from Wet Pets in our home systems. Uh, mine and then, of course, Allie's two corals as well. Uh, we have some little B-roll footage in, uh, of, the, of the corals in the tank. So uh, I hope you guys enjoy. This is actually, honestly, it is, hold on. It is April 2nd now. Um, we got those corals from Donnie. Ah, okay. So, it is currently April 2nd. We're deep in the midst of the coronavirus. <sighs> I just got so as I was saying we are currently sitting at today 6 26 p.m. it is Thursday April 2nd uh, I got this coral this is the picture I posted when I when I got it. if you follow me on Instagram uh, you saw this if you're not already make sure you go follow me there you get sneak peeks of stuff like what's behind me which I'm actually <laughs> Showing you guys before you even see the video for that too. Uh, so you can kind of get a glimpse as far as what color the light is, what that tank is. But anyway, February 22nd uh, is when this coral was in my tank since. And she's still right there right now. Loving life. There's so much euphilia in there. Tank looks absolutely awesome. So epic. I appreciate it a hundred times over for Donnie again for letting us come down and pick out some coral. Uh, if you guys are in the uh, Connecticut area, the Vernon, Connecticut area specifically, or Hartford area, um, make sure you go check them out over at Wet Pets Emporium. Um, I'll leave a link to their address and to the description below and all their social media and everything. Check those guys out. They get some cool stuff. Um, but yeah. Now let's uh, let's show you show you Allie's corals. All right, all right. We got we got to show them your corals now. Okay. All right. Come on. Hey guys, so it's a month later after we were at Donnie's at Wet Pets picking out some coral and this is the trachea I picked up and it's doing awesome. I just fed everybody so it's big and open. It's got its feeding polyps out. It's just super cool because it's a pink trachea. Like you don't really see a lot of pink corals so it's, it's really neat. It caught my eye right away and I just had to have it. So I love that thing. Um, and then over here is my bubble coral I picked up super cool you don't see those anymore you know they're just not really available i forget what they call them um it's like a toxic splatter or something um but that thing is so cool it's always got those tentacles out uh, i had to kind of put it in like on its own so it wouldn't kill anything but <laughs> it's an awesome coral i just love it a uh, huge thank you to donnie at wet pets and to everybody else there you guys are awesome and you really helped us out a lot we both got some awesome corals so thank you so much we appreciate it